Pizza Horlicks. I'm over here at Goodfellas. Staten Island. Great spot. You're gonna find out why. Let's go eat. Welcome to Goodfellas. Friday night, the place was jammed, packed. Look at that gorgeous bar, nice television screens, pizza bianca, pizza puttanesca, homemade bread, housemade. Look at that gorgeous oven. I was told the owner of the establishment builds the ovens. That's what I was told. Not sure. Look at the housemade bread, guys, served with some bright green olive oil. The bread was charred in some spots, nice aeration. I'm here to review the pizza, but before I do, I'm gonna talk about the fried calamari. You wanna say calamari, say whatever you want, I'm not judging, all right? Served with some wedges of lemon, some nice marinara sauce, little sprinkle of lemon, and then you kiss it with the marinara sauce. Oh man, tender, crispy. All right, we're here for the pizza, guys. We're here for the pizza. I'm going with a voiceover. The place was loud inside. Let's get into it. Listen. Snappy. Lots of cheese and sauce on that pizza. This pizza made me dance in my seat. Look at all that sauce. My dad needed a bib. All right. He had to put a towel on his pants because that sauce was spilling out with each bite. There was so much of it. And cheese as well. All those four cheeses, uh, the sauce was phenomenal. I'll get into that later. I just want to give you guys a look at this beauty right here. I'm not a thin crust guy. I like a hearty pizza. That crust was holding up despite all that sauce and cheese on it. Uh, the interior was beautiful. The, the restaurant was just gorgeous. Uh, not the crispiest pizza. Brick oven. But the chew was light. It was delicate. And it had some snap. Brick oven. Let's go into the lab, guys. Under the microscope we go. Here we have it, folks. Quattro formaggi, which translates into four cheeses. Fontina. Fresh mozzarella. Low moisture mozzarella and grated cheese. Take a look at the crust. Look at the ass on that pizza. Nice leoparding. Nice char. Look at the bubbles. Oh, you know me. I go bubble first. Uh, if I had to say... Anything bad about it, uh, it could have been a little tighter, but you know what? In this case, I did not mind. The, the, the basil was nice and pungent. The sauce was savory, pulpy, a little runny the way I like it. The cheese was fresh. My mom pulled the, the Blasio with the knife and fork. Me, uh, I, I just used the fork to scrape up whatever sauce spilled out, and I just put it back onto the slice because it was so saucy. The sauce would just spill out uh, with each bite. Delicious cheese, lots of moisture in it. If you notice the sign there on the oven, Goodfellas also serves as a pizza school. So you can sign up, take classes, learn how to make pizza the professional way. Ladies and gents, a little bit of ambiance here. Again, so saucy, I had to wipe speckles of sauce off my shirt. All right. It was spilling out every time I took a bite. Oh, man. No gripes, guys. No gripes. What am I going with here? An 8-4. Look at that cheese pull. 8-4. All right. This thing is one of the best on Staten and perhaps all of New York City. One of the best in all of New York City. Could have been a little tighter. Heavy pizza. Very hearty. I love it like that. All right. Could have tightened up a little bit, but it wasn't too bad. The crust held up and was able to control all that cheese and sauce. Oh, what a pizza. My goodness. Highly recommend. Goodfellas, baby. Staten Island, New York. Guys, if you can... Hit the like, hit the sub. I would appreciate it. One more thing. The staff, fantastic. 
Fantastic service. Excellent, excellent service. And I also wanted to mention the uh, the fact that it, it's it's it could have been a nine. Uh, I would have put this pizza in the nines. That's how much I loved it. I should have asked for it. Well done. And it could have been a little tighter. But it's it's very difficult to complain about this pizza. It it was just it was superb. It was superb. Head on down, good fellas. Two locations, Staten Island, New York. Hit the like, hit the sub. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Until next time, this is Antonio signing off.